She sings me songs of ungrateful souls who once thought God could bring them home on the boat. Always beautiful around here. Yeah. Yeah. So we think I'm of uh, having a little bit of fun when daybreak happens. been a while.
Yeah, I know. I uh, I've been missing Birdie. No Birdie might have a few choice words for me or something. I don't know. Hopefully. Hmm. Uh -huh. About my deal. You mean in the literal deal that I made, or? Or what the hell is the deal with me? <laughs> yeah. And at this point, what's done is done, unfortunately. He's alright. Alright, a uh, couple times. He's going clean. He's, um... Uh, not really doing crime no more, which is alright. I don't know. Still a little bit angry at me, but... Yeah. Yeah, no. Probably uh, better that she goes clean. Might uh, help us out in the long run. Always will be. Shane Beckett went clean and disappeared. You remember him, yeah? Yeah, me too. I hope to see him one day. Yeah, Martina. God, I, rem I remember her a little bit. Oh, man. She was, uh, <laughs> she was something. Good old Martina. Yeah. <laughs> Take no shit. No shit from no one. But, um, no, I mean, when the, like, yeah, I mean, it wasn't really like a, we don't like you anymore, it's more of a, uh, we have a reputation and whatnot to uphold, but they're all still going to be friends with me and whatnot. Yeah, so that's a good thing, nothing's really changing, just, uh, they're just not comfortable with me being, uh, part of the tribe or nothing like that, which is fair enough. Yeah, they, I don't know, it's weird, they have, actually no, they don't really have criminals in their tribe anymore, really just birdie, but, you know, birdie's birdie.
Oh, and there was apparently some bullshit rumor which actually wasn't true that I was apparently doing crime with the the sash on which I never did, which is absolute horseshit. Which is kind of funny. That was some people thought I was. You know how there's a they can't do crime with their sashes, sashes on type thing. People were spreading rumors that I was doing crime with my sash on, which I never did. Ever. Which I'm like, what the fuck? That was also one of the reasons I got kicked out. That was actually untrue. Which I didn't appreciate, but hey. People are going to say what they're going to say, unfortunately. I can't really control that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go get Robin out. You're back. I'll head and out. Oh, there's Tyra. Hello. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, she was just like, get out of the way, Danny. buy it put up the sign gotcha gotcha oh
Which store are we thinking of hitting? <laughs> you gonna do a classical Valentine or <laughs> the hardest of them all? Super deputies are on one, one split, I guess. Slide from there. Alrighty. at the uh, wallets. Yeah. Give him a little bit of a uh, burn down, I bet. Was that? Made a telegram not too long ago. <laughs> oh, gross. It's crap. Uh, round two. Uh. <laughs>
Yeah. <laughs> That's right, run down there, man. <laughs> Time. See who's there. All right. Careful the branches. I hit one of those before when I off my horse. <laughs> I don't think we have any deputies in town. It's too folk looking at you as heck. Okay. Sir, why are you in the middle of the road with your wagon? Come on now, why are you in the middle of the road? Oh, there's one deputy. Is that Tudor? Hello? Hi. Deputy, are you? Okay. Wait a minute. Oh, I see a beautiful face. Is that? Can I help you, big? <gasps> Duty! Hi, Duty. How you doing? Good to see you. Where you have you been? Back home. Where's back home? Denmark? Denmark, no. Netherlands? No. No. Good to Forrest. see you all. Of course, you see his mustache? Look at this. 
Oh, damn. Last time I saw you, you were going in Sisika for a... You know. The Smith That was thing. a while ago. Yeah, it's all accomplished. Not proud of it, but hey, that happened a while ago. Never again. But your mustache, though. Hmm. Well, <laughs> bye. Thank you. Appreciate that. How are you two doing? Are you looking for trouble? Uh, I don't know. It depends. <laughs> you, we're you never in trouble. Them? No, we're never wanted. No one wants us. <laughs> Don't you squint your beautiful eyebrows at me? So there would be no problem if I would check your your phone. Yeah, clean as a whistle. Only a uh, hundred robberies. Clean as Valentine. Oh, that's not that clean, Corvus. That's, that's not. Yeah, that's not too clean. <laughs> Is it just you around? Who else is around? Any other beautiful no, deputies? There's other deputies around, but I'm not sure where they are right now. I know we have a few in the central. What? Who is it? I mean... I know that Merli's around. Oh, she's not too bad. She's nice. nice All right, one. team. Jonathan is around as well. Jonathan. He feel. Oh, he feel. Oh, yeah, yeah. I've worked with him a lot, actually, uh, in medical. Me and him have done surgeries together. I remember him. He's a deputy now. Yes. Yeah. I've only seen him see. on the paper, though, because I, I did not meet him since he became a deputy. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. All right. Fair enough. Ooh. What have you two been up to? Uh, fixing up the uh, that one, you know, maintaining it, you know. How is the mountain? As beautiful as ever. Winter is coming now. Huh? Oh yeah, it's gonna be great. Winter's always great on the mountain. The snow, everything like that. I got a question, Tudor. Is this shotgun too big, too big for my back? I got it extended. And look at that wood, though. It looks so good. Oh my god. Wow. I mean, it's all right. It would look better if it was like, you know. What? Vertically on your, on your back and not... Yeah, it's normal. Aha! Yes, 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 yes. I... I understand. Yes, yes. Yeah. I'm surprised to see how empty... Valentine is. Did I say Valentine? I wanted to say Valentine. <laughs> 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 Yeah. That looks better. Yeah, that is better. God. Oh, uh, did you just wake up? Oh. Yeah, I did. Hi. Hi. Anyone causing any troubles up, up there in the mountain? No, actually. No one's actually been causing trouble, luckily. We've, uh, That's good. That's good. Been pretty peaceful. You know, we get some visitors here and then. You know, we don't mind it. Always respectful. Got some deputy visitors sometimes, which is all right. Everything's been good, honestly. Pleasant. How about the state? Is uh, I don't I know. I haven't here for heard long. much. I knew Shelby was in Cisco for a while for a bullshit murder charge. Um, it was a duel, 
Uh, I know that Honey and Cobalt are insane. They have outlaw status now. Uh, that's not the surprise. Yeah. And that's all I really know. I don't really know of any recent deaths or anything like that. Or any recent gangs or whatever. Oh, it's our friend. Is it just me or is that Wagon Man like in the way of everything? Yeah, he might be stuck in the in the mud. Not sure what's going on with him. Might try and help him. You might need to help him out there. He's probably uh, really stuck in that mud. You need to use your manly hands to manhandle that wagon out of the mud. You need to use your... <laughs> I was thinking just to <coughs> take the reins and move it, but... Yeah, that works too. Definitely works too. I will, uh... Can I help you with anything? Yeah, we're just saying hello. Showing the people that, uh... Even though they think we're gone, we're not. Never. That's good to know. Uh, kind uh, uh, of uh. you. <laughs> See you around, probably. You might skedaddle, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, in a good way. Of course, always in a good way. Never in a bad way. But probably Never. in the head somewhere, I don't know. Yeah, gifts of love. Oh. Where's where's the gift? Or the hello is the gift? <laughs> or just... Aww. Wait a minute. Did I take a break? Hold on. Beautiful, thank you for the gift. <laughs> uh, it seems like that. Should probably find a way to move that wagon before it uh, causes more issues. In just one second. You too. Dang it, you're not gonna be chasing me around anymore. Dang it. Can't make it yeah, I don't think he wants to do it. Jesus, the cheeks. I think I might have to do it the uh, rough way. Come on, sir. Is he not moving? Come on, sir. Wagon. Cooperate. You're not gonna listen. He's gonna tell you lawfully. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this He's is your last chance. It's your last chance. Eat land. I'm kidding. Oh god, there is a Oh shit. <laughs> Holy shit. You alright? I think there would have been better ways to handle this, but. <clears throat> My bad. I hope the wagon is fine. Horse is okay. Just save the day. 
looking for it. That's a beautiful hat. Fancy. Oh wow! So fancy. fancy is the oh, word, but... No, I, actually, it's more like you look—you <laughs> look like an explorer that would go into the jungles, <laughs> an Amazonian jungle. Doesn't she look like an Amazonian jungle explorer? Oh my God! How about yourself? <laughs> oh my God, Corvus! It worked though. <laughs> I see nothing new in Valentine though. Yeah, yeah, nothing new. We're walking, right? Need a long walking stick. I have my shotgun. <laughs> Which is humongous. Jacob, look at this. This is the extended shotgun. And then look at the nice wood that I got. That wood's sexy, isn't it? Okay. Too long, though, yeah. Too long, is that what you think? Oh, my... What did I just hear? <laughs> I just heard the loudest thud of my life. Do you want to know the thing about that shotgun? What's that? It does the exact same thing as mine does. It shoots. Mm-hmm. Nice. See, I don't know. I feel like I've had two revolvers, but I don't know where my other revolver is. Hmm. Go check. Why does that not surprise me? He's definitely something. Howdy. Howdy. <laughs> Hi. Sorry, just been a while since I've seen you. Ah, uh, can't wipe it. Um, alright, how about you? I'm gonna go get my horse, I'll be right back. Tutor, do I need to get your horse from the stables too, or are you gonna be able to move your ass down there? <laughs> <laughs> Did you find- I- okay, I take that as a no. You didn't find it. And don't block the road again. I saw you scratching your hand. I will not keep the hat on if that's the case. You don't know what comes with the hat. I got a cattleman, the best revolver of all. I got two holsters filled. Yay. What are you doing now with not being an undersheriff? Uh, Ride it around. Traveling, doing whatever can be done. That's when I'm not security for the Attorney General. Oh, he's security for the Attorney General. Who's the Attorney General now? Elizabeth Ashbrook. Oh, what the fuck? Really? God mm -hmm. damn. There we go. I'm gonna go grab my horse. Okay. Hello, how's it going? Hello. Have you seen Marshall Bucket or Poppy today? Who? Marshall Bucket. Who's that? He's got blonde hair, and he's real tall, Back and he... Yeah, Butcher? Mr. Bucket! <laughs> no. No, I haven't, unfortunately. Okay, have you seen Poppy? Uh, no. Who is Poppy? Poppy Bucket, right? Mr. Why is your name is? 
Luna! I'm Sunday, sister. Oh. Or Apollo. I'm gonna be Nicole, so. I'm gonna grab my horns. Sorry, I, I, I cannot help you. I did not see any of them. Okay. I like your mask. Thank you. I like it too. It's very pretty, just like you. Oh, thank you. Your horse and your hair are pretty. Yep. Oh, this is me, Lathan. Oh, don't mind me. I'm just going to re reload the revolver. I'm not going to use it. Please don't shoot me, that doesn't sound fun. No, 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 I don't shoot people. I only shoot people <laughs> if they try and kill me. I don't got a gun. Oh, okay. Fair enough. You always have it just in case. You never know when you need to defend yourself. That's true, I guess. Have you seen Trash Panda? He's running around here somewhere. Trash Panda. Why does that sound familiar? Uh, He's Trash Panda, the usurper of Blackwater. Does he wear like a raccoon hat uh -huh. on his head? Mm -hmm. uh, no. I haven't seen him lately, no. Okay. If I did, I'd so tell you. I telegram from here like a while ago, so I'm looking for him. Okay. Oh. Thank you! Yeah, have a good one. Interesting. Hmm. Wanna get out of here? Well, we're gonna get going. We're gonna mosey more around and the uh, Yeah. We need to gather up supplies for the mountain. Winter soon. In about a and month. it is. God, Tudor has the horse that literally everybody has. <laughs> They're making you pay to stay on the mountain? Well, I mean, if we want our contractor to do stuff for us, I mean, we have to pay him something. Gather up supplies yeah. and stuff. Yeah, the Fair contractor enough. wanted $700. That's like... 10 stores on a good day. I don't really know what you steal from stores. I just Money. took it off you and threw you off in the south. And food and cups and, and empire mm -hmm. kits and blankets. Yeah. Listen, we need a lot of blankets, okay? Hold up there sometimes. Sometimes. Kind of warm. How many blankets is a lot of blankets? Maybe like a couple dozen. Or more, potentially, maybe, possibly. Why do you need that many blankets? Lot, it's a lot of us up there. How many of you are up there? Oh, listen. Okay, I wasn't born about right. in the cold. I try. Okay. Got <laughs> strong muscles. Okay. I was able to lift up a wagon and, and throw it off the mountain, okay? <laughs> Why would you do that? Sounds like a waste of a wagon. It, it was, I just couldn't get out of the wagon and I just took it with my hands and threw it along with myself on accident off the mountain. You, you took your hands and you threw it in with yourself. Yeah, it was, it was some it. crazy shit. I think the wind kind of took it though, mostly. And I Hang just, on, you know, so let me get this, <laughs> let me get this straight. You were sat in a wagon. You lifted the wagon while sat on the wagon and threw it off the mountain. Well, see, it was kind of tipped over and I was like inside, you know, like the, the, the carriage space, you know, and I kind of just took it with my hands and then I threw it. But I think the wind did most of the work of the mountain. So, so what you did actually is just put more weights on one side. Uh, yep. So you didn't throw it off the mountain. No, the wind kind you of You completely took me. destroyed the wagon. <laughs> the, the wind took me pretty far. Yep. One of them pair of normal activities. What she said. What the hell is a pair of normal activity? I don't know, like, like uh, you know, uh, 
Yeah. Ghosts? Yeah, it was the mountain ghost. Mm -hmm. Mountain Spirits. ghost. Ghosts. What do they feed you up on Hagen? Jesus, if you're seeing ghosts, then I'm worried for you. Maybe some sort of like what do you meet? Never know. I don't know. Are we? Are we in strawberry right now? This might be strawberry. <laughs> yep. Maybe this is a dream. Maybe it's a nightmare. This is all a dream right now. Oh my God, we gotta go. <laughs> is he the Wendigo? No, don't say that word, Corvus. Corvus, no, don't say that. Don't say the W word. Don't say that. Oh my God. Don't say the W word. Don't do it. Yeah. Uh, oh. I don't know the guns. Where'd you go, firearms? I need a gunsmith for my cattleman. I want to get it all prettied up and cool looking and sexy. Just like me. I mean, what? Go to Rhodes or something. Have you thought about sending out a telegram for one? Good idea. It was good seeing you. Uh, we're gonna go and uh, Do you want yeah, some apple cider. Oh yeah. Oh god, watch out, Corvus. Oh shit. <laughs> oh god. You can, you know. Ice. Corvus, I have some apple cider for you. I made it myself. <laughs> <laughs> you motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, I would not trust that. I totally did not just get it from Tudor. It's giving gifts back, you know. Mm -hmm. You're exactly. welcome. Well, Y'all stay safe and have a good day, okay? That's safe. Oh, we're never in trouble. I don't know what you're talking about. He is around. Roads, post office. <coughs> Send him a telegram to stay there.
Wagon just on the road. Whoa. Hey, whatever. I wouldn't worry about it. Yeah.
probably leave. It's dusty here. Do you want to go to some like, or do you want to go to Lake Strawberry? Uh, go to the other side of state. Probably send me if you're looking okay. for a gunsmith. I mean, if I don't find one, we're probably going to uh, do some uh, business, quote unquote. I'm itching to do it for a while. and say no you know i was arrested that day i was brought in and i was dressed dressed up like you as well i, I was dressed up as you no not for doing that, the, that thing one day you weren't dressed as me at this one you literally were just also wearing black huh yeah during this robbery i wasn't in the one where we were all dressed the same you were just literally like you literally just, uh, we were both wearing black with, uh, I didn't have a bandana on, but you had the bandana up, and we were just literally both wearing black pants and the black vest. And I think because I we both have black hair. I usually admit who I am, though. That's weird. And I usually admit to who I am whenever they get me, but I guess... No, we live. We both said our names. We both said we were there. But I guess in the heat of all running around, when you freaked Corvus, they just saw, you know, oh, that's a person with black hair wearing black. That definitely must have been Mantia, even though I was long gone by then, because I was, you know, I got out of there quicker. So they thought that Weird. I was still I went screwing to around in town. Yeah, no, they arrested you, and whoever wrote the report didn't, like, investigate or ask who did what, or what part they had in it. <laughs> but when I was talking to Reed about it, I'm like, how did I get a charge for battery? I, you know, I, I got wrote, uh, Carver freed me. I got out of there, he literally wasn't arrested for any of that because they told him he- they didn't realize he was involved when he went to turn himself in for the crime. And he's like, wait a minute, he was the unknown fourth? I'm like, yeah, he showed up with me and turned himself in. <laughs> and he's like, you need to outline this whole robbery from your point of view. So I do. And then he's like, how do they mistake you for Danny? He's like, five inches taller than you. I'm yeah. like, I, I have no idea. He's like, you were nowhere near Corvus during that robbery. I'm like, not once we ran, no, we never saw each other until we met back up. Hey, what the hell? And he's like, yeah, I'm just pulling your warrant until I can get the story straight from the deputies. And if you have to go to court for this, it's $25 bail. And I'm like, oh, okay, that's like one robbery. He's like, Matias, so help me God, I will throw you in the cell if you don't stop saying things like this. We said you're doing the robbery. <laughs> Oh, I told them I'll take the robbery charge, but I wasn't going to admit that I was, you know, like, beating a deputy. Wait, what? You're dating a deputy? No, beating. Like, beating oh, up a deputy, yeah, oh, shoving him. Okay. I mean... Beating up and shoving is one different thing, but I guess they classify as pushing his beating up. <laughs> he might be the gunsmith around. Oh. Alrighty. Well. Oh, same hitching post? Okay. Okay, 
there's like three hitching posts here. Why are you being fussy, horse? and the gunsmith around. Alright, well, uh, I guess let's, uh, no, no. We don't know. Probably too early for the bit. Yeah. Well, I don't know if I'm gonna be around later. Yeah. Well, thank you. That should cover for the camp. Just need to get some nice. steel. Then anything on top of this just goes towards my uh, stable fees. <coughs> oh, also, Dan, you remind me to show you those... Uh, spots lay there for the man you oh, want to be out in Roanoke. Yeah. That's right. Provided you don't end up in jail. I mean, I'm probably gonna, but, you know, if I don't, uh, maybe, well, maybe later. Do you want to do that before you go get involved with the, what you wanted hitting a store? Yeah. Actually, I'll probably be around later too, honestly. Like a couple hours. But I know in an hour, hour 15, I gotta go take a quick nap or a quick little, uh, little reading break. That's fair. I might do that first, and if I get away, I get away. If I don't, I serve my time during my reading break. And, uh, yeah. I just didn't know what order you wanted to do things in, because I know you wanted to work towards that with Thea. Yeah, hopefully she comes around again. That's something I probably want to do with her. I know she doesn't really like robbing stores no more. And it's an... I suppose it's an entertaining sort of uh, other excursion to go on. Yeah, that too. I don't know, Corvus, you uh, want to hit the same thing? <laughs> Give him the good old run around. Just don't fall off a building. I think I might leave my horse where it is, honestly. Just run around, go on some roofs. See if the deputies can catch up. <laughs> I might come on my horse and ride up next and probably hop on. If I can do that, I would so do that shit. <laughs> Hello there. Uh, hello there. Howdy. Hello there. Uh... Um... Um... I think I know one of them. Who are they? Uh... I don't know. I'm just gonna... Go. Uh... Mm, bounty hunters are not friendly people. Um... They're definitely not bounty hunters. That's okay, so sure. just a bunch of assholes? I may know one of them from my past, but they don't know me to look like this, so I think I'm good. Okay, so very old assholes. I, I, I hope I'm wrong. I, I really hope I'm wrong, but I saw one of the cases and... Oh boy. What do you need to put that for? Can you be more specific or are you going to continue to be vague? Something <laughs> about my brother's past that affected me, the people that want me to pay them back, or else? Oh, great. Yeah. This is like, back in... New Jersey. But anyways, I don't think they know who I am in this outfit, so yay. You two have fun. Bye. Hello, our old.
old friend. We're gonna politely ask you to hand over all your money. This is a stick up. That's right. Don't worry, we'll give you half back. Butter. Ooh, kidney beans, yes. Gangs, tribes, violent assholes, don't really matter. Take a look. I'm gonna go to the other dog. And I hear a dog. Hello, dog? It looked like it was Ed in the DOP transferring someone to Sisica. Look, Corvus, you remember when, um, remember when I told you when I first kind of met you and all that about the Castillos and how, uh, I think that was them. They, they dressed the same and, and I, I saw his face. So I, I'm just going to. When I'm around, I'm just gonna try and avoid seeing Timmy. I think more. I don't know. It's kind of nerve wracking. Yeah, I think I'll be fine. They don't know this outfit. I changed a lot since then. I think we're good. Also, do you want some of the stuff I got? I got uh, rolling papers, butter, flour, knee beans, cigarettes. Which is that you want? Yeah, all right. Fair enough. Get a smoky. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Goddamn trumpet song stuck in my head. <laughs> yeah, shit. We can get a cart. We're gonna get a lot of time though. We're gonna get wagon theft. <laughs> Hopefully, I'll be able to get the deputies off your back and jump on, and then we escape into the wind. That'd be great. That'd be a hell of an escape. <laughs> Baker. Blah. Uh, you have some time. Looks like DOP rolled by and they left one right down to your left down here. No way. Corvus, where do you want me to put it? A wagon. There's a wagon. I'm gonna take. Hurry up.
This is the new Alexandria Sheriff Department. My Howdy. name is Geert Kolenaar, and I'm together with two other deputies. Good luck, deputies. Is anyone in here? Uh, howdy, howdy to you too. Are you the only person in the store at the moment? Alright, well. Uh, there are no other hostages we have to know of. There's another one coming though. Henriette, could you... All right, well, we got a call that uh, we had a store robbery currently in the in St. Denis here. Don't Why are you two food. robbing the store? I'm seeing some other figure moving around in there. Ooh, spooky. I am the other figure. Oh, goodness. <laughs> I knew it was you. Yeah, we are definitely robbing the store. We're gonna we're gonna give him back half of it though. Uh, we don't really like taking all of it. We don't want him to go too poor. But you recruit, right? You recruit, right? I am. Deputy you are blessed with the Hagen robbery. The best of the, the Hagen best. Hagen robbery. The most entertaining robbery there is in the state of New Alexandria. You are oh. blessed with Daniel Baker. I'm and the glad one to hear that. The beautiful, the only Elizabeth Cortis. You've been blessed Baker today. And Elizabeth Cortis. Corvus. 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 Sorry. Yes, yes. There you go. Beautiful, beautiful, fantastic. That's great. Well, it's good What's to meet name? you. Uh, sadly enough, I would have met you in a different situation. My name is Gerard Kolenaar. You can call me Cole. Deputy Wait, what? You can just call me Cole. I'm gonna call you Gerald. Is that, is that how you say it? Gerald. Cole, Danny. <laughs> and I'm here together with two huh? other deputies. You might have oh, already uh, known to be them rude. before. Sorry. Sorry, Corvus. <laughs> I can't help myself sometimes. Oh, wait. Do I have the fuel holes? Oh, my God. Yep. Jonathan, you remember me? Yep. We used to do surgery together a lot. That's Danny. Remember, we used to save a lot of people. Danny? Yeah, nice it's to me. Meet you too. Yeah, it's the one and only Baker. That's me. <laughs> now, why are you robbing this? I thought you were going good when you were doing surgery. Oh, no. I, I help people, but then I also rob people. Oh, okay, so you're, so you're working against yourself, that is. I mean, I've always done this. I do a little bit of surgery on the side. Oh, I think what? So. Corvus! <laughs> oh, would it be able if we can uh, stop you from doing this whole robbery thing? And you're just, uh... Kinda... With most respect, surrender? I don't know, Corvus, what do you say? Yep. Well, sadly, that's, right. that's not something we can control. They also started taxing my home. But it doesn't uh, mean we have to instantly go into robbing the stores. There are plenty of ways to earn money to uh, pay off the taxes. We know there's plenty of ways, but, you know, this is the way uh, we survive, unfortunately. We know what we're doing. No, it's not the best thing to do. No, it's a bad thing to do, but I... This is, uh... Unfortunately, how we uh, are able to pay our taxes. This is what we're good at. You know. We're not here to hurt people or nothing like that. Yeah. You take only half, no one gets harmed. Zero violence. I mean, we give them half back. We're not like all these other robbers that take the whole thing. Yes, we're still yeah, I... doing a bad thing, but you know, we'd make it a little bit less bad. I can understand that, and I can also appreciate it. But sadly enough, it's still not allowed to take only half. You're not allowed to take. We know any it's of not it. allowed. Oh, we know. 
Yeah. I understand. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. We get so it. would we be able to come to an arrangement maybe for you to not take anything and uh, just come out with, with your uh, weapons in holsters? I mean, our weapons are going to stay in our holsters. As long as you don't pull out a gun and point it at me, I ain't, I ain't going to do the same. I never pull out my guns unless I'm threatened. I'm not here to threaten you. I don't think to either of <laughs> you two to just come out and harm. Getting already good vibes about uh, all this. It's on the corner of the building right there. On the corner. But we do uh, need the new, to... Uh, the post star. So we're going to both run Kind of take you in because of all it. Would you be able to be willing to come with us? Um, hmm, I'm gonna have to think about that. I mean, see, I mean, there's one rule that I, I believe Miss Corvus usually sticks to, and the, you know, we at least gotta finish the job at least. We gotta at least do that. Well, are you gonna be able to finish the job and pay the taxes if? You're not really going to be able to get See, to the tax office with it. The thing is, you, you got to make it worth our while, you know what I mean? We, we're we not just going to come out and just, you know, not take this money and then be, you know, moneyless. And you know, you got to make it worth our while. I got to, I don't know, make the deal a bit, uh, I see. Oh, I sadly can't offer you money for not stealing, from, for not stealing or from a store. But, uh... Anything I might be able to say to convince you otherwise? Hmm. No, oh, no, I you think tell I me. could I could offer some food, and what I should have food? some um, turkey. Wait, you have turkey? Wait, hold on. Is it a turkey dinner? Hold on, hold on. Wait, wait. Mm, it is. That's Miss Harriet Henrietta. Yeah. Deputy Henriette. <laughs> and I think I, I should have some, some <laughs> bottles of, of German beer. Oh. oh damn. Crap, Corvus. She's enticing with beer. Uh, <laughs> oh my god. Uh, we really need this money, though. Mm, that's enticing, but we really need this money. Ah, oh, crud. Well, I got one bottle of whiskey and some. Oh my god! Pie. Uh. Shit, Corvus. Well, I only have a few shots on me and a little flask and uh, a few candied oranges. I gotta resist. I must resist. I gotta resist. Oh god. Whiskey and beer. And <clears throat> cigarettes. Do you have any candy canes? I do not have any candy canes. Sorry. We have candy. Corvus, what do you plan on doing with the candy cane? Yeah, she likes them big. Oh, Jesus. Big candy canes. I don't know where you get those. Nah, I only have some chocolate. But you can think of it this way, though. Getting all this food and beer, it will allow you to save up a little bit of money by not having to buy it yourself. That money you can use to spend on the taxes. Hmm. Smart thinking, That's... recruit. Smart thinking. Hmm. That way we kind of come out in the same way. The store robber doesn't get robbed. You save a little bit of money. Let me know when he's done. And he even enjoy some I'll food. Be ready to rope him just in case he tries to shoot you. That is true. That is true. Me, me and me and the me and Corvus need to talk this out. We need to need to think. No, we're gonna finish the job, but then we'll decide from there. I mean, you've made some really great offers. I'm not gonna admit. With the All great right. offers. You, you, you've definitely enticed me quite a bit. I just, uh... And it's been a while since I've had a chase, you know what I mean? This, It's been forever. <laughs> it's been about a month and a half. I would appreciate it if I don't have to run. Gotta still practice on these conditions. But you need practice with chasing, don't you? You ever been in a chase before? I've been in plenty of chases. Never as a deputy recruit, though. Never as a deputy recruit. You see, now that's even more Ew. enticing. Ooh, <laughs> now, now you said it, recruit. See, that's the thing about us, Higgins. We like teaching you recruits. We like giving you experience, you know? Teaching you how to do that paperwork and maybe chasing and all that. Well, you already mm. are giving me a lot of experience. Mm. 
I appreciate it. That, uh... You're not getting enough recruit. Not getting enough experience. Well, I've already had a long yeah. day. Mr. Jonathan and Miss uh, Henrietta have been teaching me quite a lot. <laughs> Why, thank you. I've been practicing. <laughs> you all done, Bob? Yeah, the they sure friend? have. Bump me to a secluded area where they could practice uh, some talking. <laughs> that's not, that's not no, 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 no. Right, Chorus, you're not feeling too feisty, are you? Practice, you have... yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. I'm ready to. Bump We're practicing <laughs> negotiation. Let's just put that clear. <laughs> I don't want you to throw me off when I hop on the wagon. <laughs> We're gonna go on. Either we're gonna way, go on whiskey, okay? Whiskey. I mean, when I say whiskey, have a fun time. <laughs> no, all of this was enticing, and all of that. I do and, have to uh, say that if we're gonna go with the chase, mm -hmm. we might not get the food. Nah, that's all right. We got what we came for, and honestly, that offer, that offer for that, uh, what was that? Uh, that one alcoholic drink. It wasn't the beer. I think it was. Uh, the whiskey. Beer, whiskey? Yeah, whiskey, whiskey, turkey. Yeah, that nice, nice whiskey. Yeah, See you later. Out front. Oh, oh. Don't run. Come on, stop. Come on now. Please stop running. Come on. Oh, you can't keep running. Go on, run! That's the slowest deputy I've ever seen. Ah, uh, don't go to the rooftop. Come on. Getting okay, a little friendly here. Ah, oh, Jesus. Oh. Leave, I know the roof too. God damn it. Of course, they won't, they won't stop getting on Come the wagon. <laughs> oh my god, what are we gonna do? Oh god, they're... Ah, Bro, there! Oh, come on! Come on! Come on! I'm gonna get you! One way or another! <laughs> come on! What? Uh... Wow, things are happening. Howdy.
lose then. Sure to leave us some trouble. I want to send that telegram just to show a sign of good food. True shit, you're right. Yeah, you can bring it back to them. They can't believe they left the doors open though. They left both their doors open, I just ran for it. And I had to steal two horses. One horse I fucking ran with crashed. I'm like, oh fuck. So I keep running, I go into a bush, crouch down on the bush. Uh, Jonathan passes me, so I go back, steal his horse, and get away. But like, I have my weapons, though. <laughs> I don't have any of my weapons on me. Do you know where you crashed the horse, by the way? Because that was Henriette's horse. Uh, it was in the uh, park, uh, right next to the clothing store. All right, may still be there. Around there, yeah. Hopefully. I made sure the horse was okay, and then I ran. <laughs> I'm like, oh shit. <laughs> oh god. That's crazy. Don't throw pistol with me though, god damn. <laughs> How did you make it out? <laughs> yeah, she said I, I, I pushed her with Jonathan once and they were pistol with me. I'm like, oh. And I got tied up. Oh god. <laughs> Maybe back to the mountain soon. Do a map for a little bit. Um. Okay, both these stop fussing. You see this post office post? Telegram operator just showed me it. Um. That's not good. 
Uh, which one? Also, I have no idea how to spell Jonathan's fucking name. The uh, most recent post office notice board thing here. <laughs> Name the wash their hands. <laughs> uh, can you telegram Jonathan and tell him I'll be bringing his horse to him? Should I do it anonymously? You stole his horse. True. Who the fuck else would it be? Also, I told him I'd be bringing his horse back if I found you. How do I suppose? Is it John Athon? I, I, I don't know. None of it. You could just. We could just send it to the sheriffs. Wait, why don't I just send it to the sheriffs? I got it. Alright, we should probably go. This is the sheriffs. See you later, Mathia. If you want to be a, a lot less inconspicuous, me hopping on the wagon, honestly. Hmm. Oh. Oh, God. Um. Um. Uh oh. Everything alright? You okay? Case life. get the uh, Robin to go home until the post office guy to uh, tell the master hey hey Johnny can you tell the stable hand around there to bring it back to Mount Hagen yeah there I'll leave you five dollars here There you go. All right. See you, Johnny. Thank you. Buh. Buh. I did it. I somehow escaped. Oh my god. The amount of charges I have are probably immense. Yeah, they left the cell open and untied me in the cell. I then left the outside door open, so I just ran. God, Jonathan and that recruit are so fast, though. Ridiculous. to the left corner. I, I was hopping on the wagon again and again and Henriette threw me off. <laughs> and then they both hopped in again and then threw me off again. <laughs> it was there. I guess you just didn't see it for some reason.
Out of the way, Higgins. Higgins department. Hello, goodbye. Go. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Did you smoke that peyote after you escaped? <laughs> Tim not yet. I need to get some spare weapons from the mountain. I don't know if... I don't know if it's worth throwing myself in now. <laughs> I probably have times the worst they raid batteries. I pushed one of them over. Uh, I'm off with escape robbery. Oh no. Yeah. Be. Sure will be. Yeah, it's gonna be something. I'm gonna be with people. place. I don't know what happened at this place, Corvus. This is where we killed one of those Cliffy uh, Williams members. Right on top of there. This little pass. Jesus. Yeah. Right up top here. Up above us. train right now. He can train. Oh god, um, can't see shit.
Oh, about to be late. Jeez. Thinking the Higgins Expressway, huh? <laughs> Did you open the bag yet? Not bad. Not bad. I have to sleep for about an hour for this. Then I'll probably be uh, back a week.
All right, fair enough. You're gonna be uh, awake after the storm rolls in, or uh, what you planning on doing? Fair enough. Uh, home sweet home. Oh god, oh god, careful Corvus. Oh god. You got it. I believe in you. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, back it up again. <laughs> oh god. Just just try and force him to. There you go, there you go, there you go. Oh no! Corvus, you okay? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Corvus. <laughs> Here, I got it. Oh. Okay. Here, I'll be able to get this wagon. Trust me. I got this. Then you'll make it to the rescue. Oh god, Corvus. Oh my god, Corvus. Oh my god. Corvus, are you okay? I didn't put a hop on there, you go. Oh my god, no, not again! Move, move. Oh my god! Oh no! Oh my god, I need to move! Oh my god, Holy shit, no! No way! I just caught on and it just flew! Oh my god. Uh, yeah, at least we're uh we're okay, I think. Oh no, the horse. Okay, um uh, let me grab some of the supplies up uh, the wagon though. bottles of tonics and a little bit of cash stuff. God damn wagon. All the other stuff fell out. All the food fell out.
That was so violent. That wagon. God damn. Get some rest. rest. Yeah, we gotta figure that shit out. I think I saw one of them on the balcony right across from the store and I didn't notice. I think they might have heard my fucking name. some rest for a little bit, yeah. Love you, Corvus.
Verkligheten sätter klar.